Why you should not partially press the clutch. Partially pressing the clutch pedal while driving is a common habit among many drivers, especially in heavy traffic or when maneuvering at low speeds. While it might seem like a harmless action, there are several compelling reasons why you should not partially press the clutch. This video aims to explore those reasons in detail, emphasizing the importance of using the clutch pedal correctly for safe and efficient driving. So, before starting the video, please like this video, do subscribe and turn on the notification to our channel for future updates. Premature Clutch Wear and Tear One of the primary reasons to avoid partially pressing the clutch is to prevent premature wear and tear of the clutch components. When you press the clutch pedal partially, the clutch disc is only partially disengaged from the engine's flywheel. This leads to constant friction between the clutch disc and the flywheel, causing accelerated wear and tear of these critical components. Replacing a clutch assembly is an expensive repair that can be easily avoided by using the clutch pedal correctly. Reduced fuel efficiency. Partial clutch engagement also has adverse effects on your vehicle's fuel efficiency. When the clutch is not fully disengaged, there is a constant drag on the engine, which requires more fuel to maintain idle speed. This increased fuel consumption may seem negligible during short drives, but can add up significantly over time, costing you more money at the gas pump. Increased heat generation. Clutch slippage due to partial pedal engagement generates heat within the clutch assembly. This heat can lead to overheating of the clutch components, resulting in reduced performance and, in extreme cases, clutch failure. Proper clutch operation with a fully engaged or disengaged pedal helps to minimize excessive heat buildup and ensures the longevity of your vehicle's clutch system. Difficulty in gear shifting. Partial clutch engagement can make gear shifting challenging and imprecise. When the clutch is not fully disengaged, the transmission input shaft is still connected to the engine, causing resistance when trying to shift gears. This resistance can result in rough and jarring gear changes, which not only feel uncomfortable, but can also cause long-term damage to the transmission synchro mesh and gears. Inconsistent acceleration. Driving with a partially pressed clutch pedal can lead to inconsistent acceleration and engine response. Since the clutch is not fully disengaged, power delivery from the engine to the wheels is compromised, resulting in jerky and uneven acceleration. This can be particularly problematic when merging onto highways or overtaking slower vehicles where precise control of acceleration is crucial for safety. Risk of stalling. Stalling is a common consequence of partially pressing the clutch pedal, especially for novice drivers. When the clutch is not fully disengaged, it's challenging to find the right balance between engine power and clutch engagement. This can result in the engine dying abruptly, leading to an unsafe situation, particularly in heavy traffic or when making critical maneuvers. Safety concerns. Perhaps the most critical reason to avoid partially pressing the clutch is safety. In emergency situations, split-second reactions can make all the difference. A partially pressed clutch pedal can lead to delayed response times when you need to accelerate quickly or change gears to avoid a collision. Using the clutch pedal correctly ensures that your vehicle is always ready to respond promptly to any unexpected situation on the road poor driving habits. Finally, forming the habit of partially pressing the clutch pedal can lead to poor driving habits. Over time, this habit can become ingrained, making it difficult to break, even in situations where full clutch engagement is necessary. It's essential to establish good driving habits from the start to ensure safe and efficient driving throughout your automotive experience. In conclusion, Partially pressing the clutch pedal while driving should be avoided at all costs. Doing so can lead to premature clutch wear, reduced fuel efficiency, increased heat generation, difficulty in gear shifting, inconsistent acceleration, stalling, clutch slippage, increased wear on other vehicle components, safety concerns, and the development of poor driving habits. To ensure the longevity of your vehicle's clutch system and maintain safe driving practices, always use the clutch pedal correctly 
by fully engaging or disengaging it as needed. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.